Hello everyone, and welcome back to Haunted Halls, Revenge of Dr. Blackmore. We've got a couple of puzzles here before we can save the poor Dr. Armstrong. Let's see, we need to get that thing, and we have pliers. Great, so we have this, that will help us get the thing on the top shelf. We have some vinegar here, uh, outside. Right, outside is where we're going. We have a gas mask, which is added to our portable lab, and we have a beaver! But the poor beaver can't, can't chew down the tree due to all the poison ivy, so use the tomahawk to clean the tree. Meanwhile, in the background, uh, you'll notice that... Wait, did the beaver just pull a tooth out of a jar? The beaver just pulled a tooth out of a jar. I'm pretty sure beavers don't work like that. Anyway, in the background is the Great Chicago Fire. Oh no! Beaver! I keep getting interrupted. In the background is the Great Chicago Fire. And the poor beaver chipped off the tooth which it pulled from out of the jar. Okay, so, oven mitts. Can I shut this thing? No, I cannot. Can I use the poker? Good, use the poker, and then the oven mitt to get an iron tooth, because people keep teeth inside ovens. Oh yeah, that's working so much better than the tooth from the beaver's jar of teeth. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Beaver. Thank you. Now we have a ladder. Thanks, thanks to the beaver. This is so weird. Um, <clears throat> uh, umbrella over here. Now we have baking soda here, so obviously we add vinegar to baking soda. This gives us another passcode, X27Z. X27Z. Use the ladder here. Now we can take a look at this picture where we have a puzzle. We want to recreate that thingy. So let's see, um, the top looks like this. The two horns like that. The bottom looks like that. With a tooth like that. And the middle looked like that. Now we have a sword and we can go upstairs. Uh-oh, it's Dr. Blackmore. You know, poisonous gas isn't the only thing that causes hallucinations. They can also be caused by burning certain combustibles in a fire. Dr. Blackmore is basically saying, hey, guess what? He's giving us a hallucination of an evil firefighter. Aw, oh, man. Why can't I ever hallucinate about somebody who's going to help me? Well... Okay, let's fix the gas mask. So we need salt. Okay, so we're gonna blend it and then put it into that and then blend it with seeds. Salt and coal, blend it together, put into this, put into the blender along with some seeds. So, uh, how does our character know how to use this portable laboratory? Where does the portable laboratory come from? I don't know. I don't think the game explains. In any case, guess what? The gas mask works now, and it will destroy the hallucination. Because that's how gas masks and hallucinations work. Use the pliers here to open up a hidden objects challenge! Oh dear. The special item we get is the salt shaker. Which we actually have to use downstairs, over here. This is another challenge, like the Hidden Objects Challenge, which takes a while. Basically, cook according to the directions. 
So three fourths broccoli plus one eyeball plus half of a pear. Ah, maybe that's an apple. Set on fire gives us something. Pepper. Along with a fourth of whatever that is. You have to clear the board after every single use, by the way. A fourth of that stuff, and a fourth of the apple. So as you can see, we have four different recipes that we are creating. I don't mind this challenge, it's a good challenge. My problem is that it just takes too long. So, uh, when you solve this puzzle as quickly as possible, it's not that much faster than waiting in place and then using the skip button. Okay, so a fourth of this thingy. Plus some salt. Alright, final thing. Three-fourths of whatever that is. Is that an onion? Looks like an onion. Six sugar cubes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eyeball. Hand. Half of this thingy. And there we go. So now we have a giant pumpkin. So these things are going to be used over here. Let's see, we attack this guy with the tomahawk. Wow, that's violent. Uh, this guy, we put a pumpkin in the exhaust pipe. Then we stab the guy with the sword. Giving us access to this area where we input the two codes that we have. These codes being X27Z4ZHK. X27Z4ZHK. And this is a dynamite puzzle. We want to get the things to add up to 4 and 5. So click the red button twice. Then click the blue button, I mean the green button, five times. We did it! We saved Dr. Armstrong! Hooray! Oh, thank you. I never imagined my conflict with Blackmore would end like this. Apparently, he's been holding a grudge against me ever since I criticized his methods back when we were colleagues. I believe he's imprisoned several other people. Hopefully, you'll be able to save them as well. Good luck. Good luck, Dr. Armstrong. And he just walks through a magical portal, which takes him through time and space. Oh, 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 ho! Did you see? Mr. Whiskers, the cat followed him! So he drops a disc piece and a blue energy orb. Both of which are up here. Oh no, hidden objects challenge. The item we get from here is glue. And over here on the desk, we have the disc for Chernobyl. We put it here, and we use the glue. Because that's how you can fix compact discs. Yep. Chernobyl, here I come! Boy, that's a phrase I thought I'd never say.